Hey, hi you all, StarBlog Emails. Today I'm gonna show you how I build the Red Oak Mini. As you know, very first step, let's looking at the artbook. Let's look at the artbook. At the end of the book, we have the hero. Here is Red Oak. As we could see, there is a very few different tones. Light brown for the rifle, military green for the suit, and blue and red for details. As you know, if you watch my other tutorial, we first make pre-lighting. First, put color on your clothes. Choose a basic white color. Here I use the dead white from Valero. Soak your brush inside it. Then remove the more color you can. When your brush is dry, you can dry brush. Try to insist on edges. It will make your mini more sunny. We first paint the flesh using a barbarian flesh from the army painter. If we see well, Red Oak have a scar here. Don't worry about that, we manage it later with the flesh wash. Next step, we'll paint the suit using the military green plus equal part of contrast medium from Citadel. Use a small brush to do this part. Next for the cape, we'll mix equal part of military green plus black templar from the contrast set, using a large shade brush. And don't forget to paint the back. We'll use the Black Templar from the contrast set to paint boots and belt and other details. Then we apply a second layer on the boot to make them darker. We now use Black Templar plus Agarose Dunes at equal parts to paint the chest. And as we are in a tutorial speed painting, we also make the rifle later.
and we could also paint the hat. We now paint the metallic parts, the rifle, plus details on the chest. For that I use the gunmetal from Prince August, but any other metallic paints will do the job. For the strip, we'll use the contrast skeleton orb. I paint the ears using a yellow shade. For example, here are the castle render yellow from Citadel. Let's paint the flesh wash using any flesh wash. For example, here I use the Army Panther wash. It will highlight the scar on the right cheek. We now make the rifle darker using the dark tone wash from the Army Panther. And we also darken the cape. For this tape, use a large wash brush. We now paint the base quickly, mixing a basilicum grey plus contrast medium. Finally, I want to give the cape a special red light. It reminds the communist origin of Red Oak. And we give Red Oak ears some red reflects. This video is finished. I hope you like it. Thanks for watching it. By subscribing to Star Board Games, you will find tons of tutorial speed painting on Hitch Buster and other many many board games. And see you soon for another tutorial speed painting. Have a good play, have a good game, and goodbye. <laughs>